How was it? Yeah, it fits better after the changes we've done. So, steering wise, it felt pretty good. The chassis. But I uh, had some issues with the, with the engine cutting out. So I had to, to drive pretty slowly. But chassis wise, it's a good improvement from earlier today. What is up? <laughs> what is up? What? <laughs> Okay, you good, man? It's been a long drive again, and now we're here, and so excited to check this out. Oh and of course it was a long ride, because you were without me. Exactly. Where's your co-driver, man? I missed, I missed you, man. <laughs> I missed you too. I missed you. But, to be honest, I had a pretty, pretty good day with these guys. Can so, be better I didn't me. miss you as much. Nice ride, man. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Smooth, it's fast. And super quiet. It's super like... Quiet. Dangerously quiet. Yeah, seriously, when you park, you just go like, did I turn it off? Or, and it goes ridiculously quick. It goes like zero to 100 kilometers per hour in uh, three seconds. Dude, you could, even, like you could race with this one with these guys. You accelerate and you can just push back in the seat. You, so have to, you have to take me for a ride. Go for that. tomorrow. So uh, can you tell us about uh, today, what's, what's happening? So yesterday was a track day, test day, and today there's a competition and a race for the, the lower street classes. Yeah. And we had to shake 10 passes uh, in the afternoon that we're going to do some contesting in. Uh, but unfortunately the weather is, uh, well it's raining a lot. Yeah. So unfortunately we can't be, be running these type of tires today. Look, th check these out. So instead we need to, um, to run on other type of tires. We have them right here being baked up to, to a higher temperature until we get the, the rubber up to, to its optimum uh, temperature for the optimum grip. And obviously with the rain, it cools down the tires a lot. So yeah. you need to have them heated already when you enter the track. So, so um, we have some stuff left to, to do on the car. And then we're gonna adjust the, the chassis to, to soften up the car yeah. to make it more, um, to move it around a little bit more on the track. Yeah. Because with a lower grip in the rain, you need to, to have the car, the chassis, uh, work a little bit more to get more grip. Because it might rain tomorrow during the race. So uh, in that case, it's good for us to do a test today in the wet. So, yeah. so we know how it feels tomorrow. Uh, yeah, I can just say it's so exciting to be here, to be standing inside of this, this uh, circus. Everybody's doing their thing. Some extreme passion into what they do and the hours they put down. So not even talk about the money they put down into it. So it's, uh, uh, it's really impressive. If you don't really have the passion, then it's not going to work. And, but if you have the passion and the drive, then you're going to get up and you're going to do it, whatever the resources you have. I mean, you see people here at the track. I mean, of course, people have, you know, some have more money, some have less money to put in. But they share the same passion and they do what they can with, they do the best what they can with what they have. And it's because they have the passion to do it. Yes, yeah, so, I mean, last summer I think the, the best moment of the whole year was at an event called King of Montorp. Montorp is like the reference track for racing in Sweden. And it's the track where the, the lap times count the most. I've been at that event you know, for several years and you know the potential and you know, all the hours you put in and you know that if it works you have the potential to really you know, take home the event but it's always been something you know, breaks or something happens it's, so you always you know, fall on the, like the 
finish line. It's so frustrating because you know that the capacity is there. But you need to have that to feed the hunger, to, to really be more determined to go home and you know, make something even better to come back you know, next year and, and hit it off again. So you, need, you, need to, you need to thrive on that motivation. So last year, the best moment of the whole year was actually at that event. And we've been working really hard. We rebuilt the engine the night before, and the weeks before, and everything worked. Yes, we set a, a really good time, a new track record for semi sticks And it was several seconds quicker than the previous record. So I think everyone was really shocked about the time. And you know, I was just screaming in the car. And, yeah, I was screaming in the, in the pit. What was your feelings right there, right then, when you... Uh, I was so much emotion. Actually, I could get goosebumps right now just thinking about the whole, the whole situation. Because then, you know, doing the cool down lap to go in, in the pit again, actually, you know, I felt tears. Nice, because... So emotional. We're in the crew now! Yeah, it's about up on the maximum. Let's do this. It's countdown, it's about 20 minutes down, so Gustav is gonna go out. He's feeling a bit nervous actually because it's wet. All these hard work he's been putting down on the car and now it's all gonna be put to test. Track oh, really? Yeah, the, the fourth gear did it go in. Then I was, you know, the focus went down to the dash display. Did it have enough room left on the track when I lost uh, the focus for a, for a split second? And then... <laughs> so it's but, from the dirt. Yeah, the... That template. Yeah, exactly. So it, it literally became like a shovel. Oh, but but uh, you managed to save the, oh, the, the carbon yeah, fiber. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, somehow. Yeah, so the car... Oh, no. oh, no. We need to do some repairs tonight. Classic. Classic. Yep, so we need to take out some, some carbon fiber and epoxy. That's, that's what happens when you're racing, when you try to push the limits. Shit happens. Yeah, but uh, the good thing is that the changes we did to the steering geometry last night seems to work. So it's much easier to handle now. Let's just hope for the good weather tomorrow. Absolutely, because then I feel pretty confident that we can not win, but at least be in the top, so hopefully. So I fucked up the car a little bit, not too bad. Sun came out, now we're gonna get some beer. Alright, let's do this. Get some food! Uh, 772 horsepower, 510 in the back, 262 in the front. Forward drive, you get full effect from the start. So let's do let's this. Kick it. Three, two, one. <laughs> nice, there we go. And 120. So it's uh, zero to 100 for uh, about three seconds, quarter mile, 10.2. You're really getting sucked into your seats when you go, and it's so weird because you don't get any sound. <laughs> it's just pure, I mean, pure joy. Kick it. 150. 
You know, now I can feel no. what they're doing on the when they're driving on the yeah, track. Yeah, do you? Two hands on the wheel, full focus, getting in wide like it taught us. Yeah. Coming in close <laughs> into the apex. And that's like the, that's stuff the, did. He took a split second off the road down to the other and he was gone. Yep. We're not gonna do that. We always drive legal, right? Always. <laughs> always. Especially when we go to Norway. So there's the cops. Oops. Self driving. Nothing. Ah! And it's <laughs> so it's, you Don't can see cheat. here, it's yeah. following the, like it's... Yeah, the lines. Yeah, it's the following, lines it's what the fuck? Where it's going and Look, it's, it's perfect. perfect. But it's pretty crazy, like... It's better than you. Yeah, it's better than me. Your car's yeah. a better driver than you. I trust this car more than you. You should. 140, 140 150, 160, 160, 160, 170! Perfect. Six pack of coal, I don't know if you're going to do it. <laughs> Någon må nytta måste vi göra. Det här är inte en det skit. We're here with some beer. <laughs> Finally. Well, we did such a success with the barbecue yesterday. I'm thinking we just take care of it today too. I think so too. And they yeah, just I feel like an animal. Just, <laughs> animal. just give it. To oh, it's cold. How you feel? Uh, I feel pretty good. Pretty nice. Been a uh, been a long day. Exhausting day. <laughs> my ass off. <laughs> Sitting here with a beer, relaxing. Yeah, Cheers. Cheers. Gonna light up the barbecue and uh, same procedure as yesterday. Yeah. Oh.